Hey, how's it going? This is going to be a quick demo of the new DTools PDF Cloud Converter. This is a uh, PDF file that was created uh, using the AutoCAD Save As PDF Export function. A um, couple things you want to do first is you want to um, check out the properties over here, and you're going to see that this is a 42 by 30 inch page size. And then I also want to take a look at the scale, too. The scale is, uh, in this case, it's an eighth of an inch equals one foot scale. Um, Next, I want to edit the layers, and really what I want to do is I want to take out the title block, the, the, the dimensions, and some of these IDs here, which really aren't needed for the work I need to do on this project over here. So I'm going to start editing this title, title block over here, and you can see I got all that stuff out. Um, I believe that's all the ID pieces. And we got the dimensions. Um, Right over here, and there we go. So you can see I've got a much cleaner file now at this point. Uh, makes things a little bit easier because you really don't need all the information in your document. Um, however, this is just—I'm not doing anything at this point. I'm just trying to identify which which uh, layers we want to we want to take out. So I'm going to drag this over here, and I've got my DTools file already open. DTools Visio. I'm going to go to uh, Add-ins and then DTools Insert PDF Background. You get some quick instructions over here. I'm going to find the file, and you'll see this uh, Insert PDF Background UI will will pop up here. Um, I'm going to hit the Select Layer UI, and you can see I've got a view of the of the layers that I was just editing in my um, in my PDF. And then uh, I need to get rid of this one here. Um, title block medium. And then I believe it was. Um, okay, now as you can see, this is going to change this background image. So now we've got the we've got the image we want. Um, I can give this a custom name if I like, or I can just, uh, if it's going to be a plan, elevation, or line, if there's multiple pages, it'll just be plan-1, plan-2. Uh, what measurement units, in this case, I'm working in inches. Uh, I want to use the uh, PDF page size. Um, I want to change it to eighth of an inch. And I'm going to use, um, let's just say I don't want to use a background title page. I'll add that later. I want to uncheck size to fit page. So I've basically done everything I have to do at this point here. And I'm just going to click insert. And it just brought it in. It's that quick. I should mention that it, it brought this in as scale too. So I can, um, I can crop it if I want. Um, I didn't do a good job editing, editing the layers over here, so I still have a little title uh, bar block. Just by using the crop tool and um, dragging it over here. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Using the crop tool. <laughs> there, sometimes it goes invisible when the screen camera's running. Here we go. So you can see I got rid of the title title block at that point. Uh, next, I want to lock this down over here. So I'm going to go to my layers and um, layer properties, and then we assign all the layers in Visio to the PDF background layer. So I'm going to lock it, and I'm going to turn off snap and glue just because it makes things easier when you're adding stuff on top of this over, over here. All right, so I've got a layer um, dropped into dropped into um, an AutoCAD PDF layer drop, dropped into um, Visio. I can start layering on top of this, layering my Visio objects on top of this here. And then to show you how good the fit, fidelity is, I'm going to go um, save as. I'm going to go um, save as PDF. And then here is the PDF of that file. And if you look over here, the fidelity is amazing. So this is the, this is the file that's been through um, uh, all, all of the con conversions. Maintains scale, maintains vectors. This is the original PDF plan that came from AutoCAD.
really it's uh, it, it's hard to tell which one's which. I'm really happy with the with the with the fidelity and quality and speed of this product. I think you guys will be too. Uh, let us know if we can do anything else.